In the meantime, you know what's happening tonight? Governor Gavin Newsom is debating Florida Governor Ron DeSantis on Fox News. Yeah, at stake here? Well, that's not entirely clear. <laughs> Scott McGrew is going to walk us through this one. Yeah, what is at stake? I, is it pride? It might be pride. Yeah. But pride might be awkward in Florida. There's <laughs> nothing at stake. These two men are not running against each other. Newsom isn't running for anything at all, at least not yet. But the debate was his idea. And DeSantis could use the attention as he's falling behind in his run for president. Not hard to imagine a day when Newsom runs for president if Trump wins this time around. Maybe it's a preview for five years from now. Newsom versus DeSantis. There's an outside possibility that President Biden changes his mind about this election and Newsom steps in. It's unlikely, but it could happen. But it's mostly spectacle. Newsom said to DeSantis, I'll bring my hair gel, you bring your hairspray. The two governors scoring points at home by fussing at each other. I want to get this right. You called him a small, pathetic man and asked, quote, kidnapping charges. Is that is that what you believe happened, Governor Newsom, that Florida kidnapped migrants and brought them to California? Yeah, I think I'm being generous, small and pathetic. Uh, very generous. He's just weakness masquerading as strength. Yeah, he's flailing, desperate for attention. Each governor brings some strengths and weaknesses to the debate. Let's start with DeSantis. Now, one of the biggest advantages for him, he doesn't have to defend anybody but himself. As a Republican, he can attack Biden, but he's running against Trump's in the primary, so he can deflect any criticism of Trump. A weakness, I think it is fair to say that DeSantis struggles with connecting with voters. The polling numbers show the more they get to know him, the less they like him. And his position on abortion is counter to the majority of Americans who support abortion rights. And Newsom has been attacking him on that. Here's a clip of an ad voiced by Newsom. Abortion after six weeks will be punishable by up to five years in prison. Even though many women don't even know they're pregnant at six weeks. That's not freedom. It's Ron DeSantis's Florida. DeSantis has one other weakness, and that's he's got a lot to lose because he's got a lot to gain. He's running for president. He needs to pull votes from both Trump supporters and more and more Nikki Haley supporters, and they will be watching tonight. Now, Gavin Newsom has absolutely nothing to lose. He's not running for anything. His ab position on abortion matches the majority of American voters. His disadvantage when DeSantis brings up Biden in the debate, Newsom is going to have to defend him. And then there are the images seen around the world of California and what it looks like in our malls and in Union Square. Major retailers moving out. These are the images many of the world think when they think California. The debate will be 90 minutes. It'll be on Fox News. Marcus, it starts at 6.